I really need to do laundry. So just like Johnny Cash says, grab your cleanest dirty shirt. Flying out of California today, on to the next destination. And that was a rare occasion that I actually use a brush. Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here, only to be messed up by a hat anyway. It's my second channel, daily vlog channel. It's the Daily Woo. Sitting in my lap is a Ziploc bag full of old school vintage Star Wars toys, and that could only mean one yes. thing. It's Count Stankus yes. here. Yes. Where are you? Back. Where are you taking me right now? These are in in super great shape with their little cape. Look at Vader here. You don't know the power of the whimsical plastic lightsaber. There's the Star Wars land construction as of current day. Ah, Disneyland. So good to see you again. Not here for long, but I had to stop off and say hi. There's a humongous Mickey pumpkin with a weird smirk on his face. Looks like the castle has a little bit of snow on it. It's always good to see these two friendly faces. And my favorite coffee stand right here by the castle has added donuts to their arsenal. Should I get a donut? Adam, look at the size of those donuts. That's a yes? yes. Three, two, one. Holy, you just like took a massive bite out of that. How is it? Good. All right, I'm done. I can only eat about half. Jay the Loner hanging out over here, listening to the Disneyland band. Oh yes. I'm pretty excited about this. Pirates at Disneyland. Twice as long as its Disney World counterpart. Hello, hello. Cruising through the bayou into the darkness. They always say to keep your ruddy hands on board. Are your hands ruddy? I know they're, I know what muddy hands are, but what's a ruddy hand? I've had this. It'd be too late to alter course. Oh no. Something's happening. <laughs> and here we go, drop number two. There are two drops in Anaheim. Yeah! Don't get wet, don't get wet! Oh, okay, that was that was a little better. There's a seagull perched on top of that skeleton. Hitchcock would be proud. Shift your cargo, dearie. Show them your larboard side. And in very bizarre fashion, it is raining in Southern California. What the heck is going on around here? It's still pretty beautiful, though. Especially, it's really cool, the fact that Walt himself stood on that little train gizmo. In fact, there is a photo on the wall right here. There he is. Look at the sheer amount of people that are in line for Haunted Mansion Holiday. A lot of people really like that crazy old Jack Skellington. I wonder if Mr. Oogie Boogie will rear his ugly head in there. Oh, not you, Count Stank. I'm talking about Mr. Oogie Boogie. Oh, look, there he is. There's that guy, Oogie Boogie, up there in the moon. Oh, yeah. Something weird's going on over here. That plant is like singing. It's singing a song. That's the most terrifying wreath in the history of wreaths. It smells like gingerbread in here, and for that, I'm not complaining. And even Hattie is in the spirit. Look at him right there. He's got a bow on top of his hat box. Looking very beautiful, Hattie. Santa Claus? That's not Santa Claus. That's Jack! And look over here. Looking lovely as always. Hello. Whoa! He is in here! You told me Oogie Boogie was not in here this year. You know, like, you know I'm terrified of him. 
One last shot of Main Street before I head out. Good to see you again, Disneyland, even though you were raining, which is kind of nice. It creates a little ambiance. Not sure when I'll be back, but glad I got to see it before I left. And the old EP Ripley just hanging out over there all by its lonesome. That's the train that Walt rode in on on opening day. And the old House of Blues building is still here for now. Rumor is they're gonna bulldoze it. About to consume some delicious pizza. And this guy is overseeing the process. What's wrong? It's scary. They make it right in front of you so you can see how the magic is made. Look at all that goodness. So this is what we're dealing with. I got the ravioli. Count Stankus, you got, what'd you get? I don't know. It's just like a mishmash of pasta. pasta Over seafood. here we have an epic pizza with mushrooms. And look at this, your pep little pepperonis. They're like the cutest pepperonis in existence. And you got a little like feta cheese on there mm -hmm. and some olives. Man, this is this is gonna be good. Once again, time to say goodbye to this neck of the woods and move on. Count Stanka's cat name is Lord Vader. Right? Yeah, you don't seem too menacing. Lord Vader. You're not very menacing. You got a little costume for him, a little Vader costume. Do you say he doesn't like to wear it? No, we tried to put him on him and he freaked out. Why won't you wear your costume? Put your Vader costume on. Vader hat. Come on, put the Vader hat on. Lord, Come on. Lord Vader. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> I am your kitten. The Emperor is not as forgiving as I am. You have a lot of uh, decapitated body parts just yes. hanging out here in your garage, yes. Count Stankus. What does one do with a severed head? Exactly. Why do you own this? I don't know. Terrifying spider here that really gets things in the old Halloween spirit. <laughs> Whoa! And there's a bat over my shoulder. That's not, you know, creepy in any possible way. There's even a little vulture here perusing the garage. Yeah, that's gonna be good. So you're just gonna like film him in front of the, uh, the rock wall. <laughs> if I want to do the voice, I have to put the glasses on because you can do a better Arnold when you're wearing the glasses. That's right. What's going on over here? Remember, if you subscribe, You'll be back. Come on, you don't need the remote to the TV. Put down the TV, watch YouTube, come on. <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah. Come on, Bennett, it's toy review time. Okay, one more time, I messed that one up. Come on, Bennett, it's toy review time. Let's party. Ah, uh, yes. Once again, time for a flight. There's a lot of flights departing out of LAX. Here's some things they don't want you taking through security. Shaving cream and LaCroix beverages. They must have something against LaCroix for whatever reason. Truth be told, I kind of wanted to stay in LA a few more days, but I have made a promise to myself to keep moving and never stay more than three, four, five days tops in one location. So late last night, I booked a flight to the next spot on a whim. It's pretty interesting that it's been raining a couple days in my tenure here in Southern California. I think it's rained about half the amount of times in my four day visit than it did in the year and a half I used to live out here. The days are numbered on my duffel bag. It's a big hole and a tear in it. It's only a matter of time before it completely disintegrates. That was a little bit unusual. We drove across the runway to get to another building where now I'm going to load onto my plane. This is 
a small plane. I don't know if that's good or bad.